chances. Uh, there could be some snow flurries for North Alabama tomorrow morning and into the midday hours. No accumulation, anything like that. A high pressure starts to move in by Thursday morning. Here is 6 a.m. And this is on Thursday. This is going to be our coldest point. Uh, temperatures at that time could be in the single digits north of I-20. Along and south of I-20, temperatures in the low teens. It will be a very cold now as we go into Friday. Interesting setup. A disturbance moves in. Very cold air still in place. There could be some snow flurries across Alabama on Friday, Friday afternoon, and Friday evening. At this point, no accumulation expected. Something we'll keep an eye on over the next several days. Either way, it will be cold as we go into the next several days of the weekend. Here's forecast for Wednesday night. The overnight lows 12 to 14 for places like Tuscaloosa, Greensboro, Livingston, Clanton, over towards Rockford, Talladega, Sylacauga, areas like that. And as you go further off towards the north, places like Birmingham, uh, Fayette, Jasper, Coleman, Hamilton, 8 degrees to 11 degrees. Area-wide, we are talking about a wind chill value. Get this now, negative 5 to 5 degrees. It will be dangerously cold across the state Wednesday night and early Thursday morning. Forecast for tonight, still going to be cold tonight. Overnight lows in the upper 20s. I look for a clear sky. Tomorrow turning colder. Temperatures only top out of the upper 30s. Will be windy. Uh, winds could gust as high as 25 tomorrow afternoon. Arctic blast says it all. 12 degrees on average Wednesday night. Highs only at 30 on Thursday. A few snow flurries are possible on Friday across Alabama. Sleep pellets south of I-20. And as we go into Saturday, we'll be dry and cool. Uh, temperatures top out in the low 40s on Saturday, 40s to near 50 as we go into Sunday and Monday 